and welcome back to my channel. If you are a returning subscriber or viewer, thank you so much. I appreciate your support and your loyalty more than you know. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you click on that little red subscribe button. It's way over there in the corner. I would love to have you come back and join me again. I hope everyone gives this video a thumbs up and a comments, of course, are always, always welcome. So I'm going to be putting together another Outfits of the Day video. It's not going to be an every day this week, but just if I have something special or something that I just want to show you, then I'll do it and then I'll put together like a quick five or six videos and kind of splice them all together. So today I am wearing some cut from the cloth boot cut jeans. Love the boot cut jeans. I'm glad to be getting back into them. And these I actually got right from the cut from the cloth website. They were having some, not all of them, but some of the uh, boot cut jeans and the corduroys were on sale for like $35 and change. And I had a coupon and a code. So I actually got two pairs of the boot cut corduroys for $26 and change each. Shipping was free. Just love them. So I got these uh, olive green ones that I got a deep olive green. And then I got a nice bright burgundy one as well. I'm wearing uh, some boots from booties from QVC. These are from Gilly. They're a nice olive green. They got about a two inch heel. I'll show them a little better when I get closer. And the top that I'm wearing is from Renee C. This is from the uh, Attitudes by Renee line from QVC. Didn't exactly know what to wear with camo, so I just kind of kept my jewelry simple today. So I've got um, I got two different Chanel's on. I've got this long one, and it's gold. A lot of times I wear silver, but this one I kept in gold to go with the camo. So it's got all these crystals on it, and this long one, and then just a little mini one right here. I could just wore those gold hoopla earrings in. I don't have a lot of gold from the uh, Touchstone Crystal. I've got mostly silver, so I might have to do some shopping. And I did get some new items this weekend from a Touchstone Crystal in my mail. So this one is like that lunar ring that you've seen me wear thousands of times in silver. I got this one in gold, so if I can stay still, it might focus. Just very, very pretty. I mean, my lights don't do it, but when you just, it just sparkles, just love them. So the pocketbook that I'm wearing, this handbag, I actually, after I shoveled this weekend, I thought I, I needed to reward myself. I don't know why I thought that, but I knew that Coach and Michael Kors were both having some sales at the outlets. So I went uh, know, five minutes down the road and I ended up getting that mustard bag that I wanted to go with um, that vest that I wore in my last outfits of the day video. So it's a nice tote bag. It's that nice mu mustardy color. It's a pebbled leather, so it's a really soft. Um, of course, Coach always comes with their signature thing. And then I got this one a couple of years ago at that store. Just a little little bag bling to put on. Um, the back has that pocket to get into. Of course, if you wanted to put your phone in there real quick. Love the, uh, the gold chains on the handle. And I took, I did wear this today, but I took everything out so that I could open it up and show you without everything falling out. So it's a nice big open compartment. Um, this one's got those two little pockets right here. And then this one's got a big zippered compartment to put things in. So anyway, this would have been $398. But as I said, they were having another great sale. So I got it for $109. And there you go. So it was $289 off. I should really go and check out their sales more often. But I want to show you these booties. And I was fell in love with these on the QVC website. Um, I forgot when it was. Sometime last year. Maybe a year and a half ago. But they're like $140. And I did not want to spend $140. So I stocked their clearance as is. Hoping that somebody would buy them and had the wrong size and return them. And so I, my persistence paid off. And so I got these for $50 and change. Plus they were still on six evil pay. So can't go wrong. And again, so these were used. They were re either return or maybe they wore them during the demo. And they are in great shape. And the ghillie shoes, um, I've had really good luck with them. They've got nice padding. So you got nice padding on, under the balls of your feet and right here on the heel. And you just feel supported. I wore these today at work and I still pedaled over eight miles on my elliptical. That's how comfortable they are. Love these shoes. 
so anyway that is my look for today i want to thank everyone for joining me um i don't know when i'm going to be back like i said i'm just going to kind of do it randomly and then when i get a few uh, videos a few outfits and i'll put it together and share with you so thanks everyone for joining me and we'll chat again soon i hope you go out and have a fan and welcome to thursday you know some of the outfits that i've been doing because i'm not doing it in order i just label as day one day two day day three and i have no idea what day it is when i when i look at them now but today is thursday i'm cold um we still have people hanging around at work for classes and training but i don't care i'm cold and i'm dressing to be comfortable i think we're going to be in the 40s this weekend but right now it's cold so to start my look up, I am wearing these little ankle booties. They're all weather booties that I got from QVC on the as is. There are some ZBs or BZs, uh, little faux ankle booties, some faux uh, black fur right here. They're all weather. So if it rains or snows, I'm covered, little rubber soles. So I'm not gonna slip anywhere because I am pretty klutzy. Got a cute little buckle right here, like in a gunmetal type color love these tabs because they help pull them on if you're in a hurry to get them on and off the pants that i'm wearing are actually spanx leggings these are velvet also got these on the qvc as is website they are i got them maybe a year a year and a half ago when i was a large right i've got them tucked up to here and i don't care they kind of squish and everything but that's okay um for 33 dollars I thought I'd squish and tuck whatever I can in these until I can't wear them anymore. I did get my money's use out of them. I wore them a lot over last winter. So I am going to love wearing these till I can't wear them anymore. The top that I'm wearing is from Walmart. I got this on their website. I didn't see it at the store. I'm not going to say it's a boat neckline, but it is a nice wide neckline right here with this uh, white trim. It's got the animal print sleeves that I really love. It's got this little front knot detail right here and it is soft it's heavier than a t-shirt but it's not like a sweat sweater or sweatshirt but it's like a thick t-shirt material very soft very warm it's a nice length to wear with leggings for my jewelry because of course I, I have to have some bling no matter how cold I am so I have well, I'm wearing both the uh, my Luna rings here so I've got the gold and the silver just love wearing them together they also got a blush color so a blush rose gold or something like that so i might have to get that one too if anyone's having a party hint 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 i i need to order more i got this eclipse ring on from touchstone crystal and then that ring too is also by touchstone crystal by swarovski i'm wearing my gold hoopla earrings because i'm wearing this kind of color i just thought it needed some more gold I'm wearing two Chanel necklaces. I've got um, a black, one with black crystals, and then the other with the Aurora Boreal crystals that just kind of catch all the light and just reflect all different ways. Alrighty, so this is my look as I head out the door. I hope everyone is warmer than me. Sometimes you, it, it's not even cold anymore. You just kind of get that cold in your bones and, that, and that's it, you're done. So anyway, well, have a great day we'll chat again soon everyone bye-bye hi everyone so welcome to monday so this is my look as i head out the door i've got uh on of course my touchstone crystal by swarovski so i've got that gold lunar ring on i've got this uh, ring from heidi douse from home shopping network i've got on my touchstone crystal by swarovski i've got these gold hoops i really need to get some more gold things from them um this necklace, of course, from Touchstone Crystal by Swarovski. I'm a Touchstone Crystal girl. And I've got two Chanel's on. So I've got one, one is like a pointed yellow crystal, and the other one's the Aurora Boreal. So just, um, it, they just shine and sparkle. And because it's got that yellow stone in there, it kind of looks kind of gold from a distance. So, worked for me. I'm wearing it with this Time and True turtleneck sweater that I got from Walmart. Um, I think it was like $9.99. They're on sale now, but I can never seem to find my size when I go. And again, just to, you know, they, they last a season or two, so not too bad. I've got this skirt on that I got from the Mix and Match Boutique. So it's like a midi length uh, animal print. It's got this slit right here, and it does have this uh, built-in slip that goes all the way around. 
when I first got it and because I hadn't you know you just look at the little pictures it's got these all these tiny tiny fabric colored buttons that are really really pretty but when I looked at it I'm like oh my god it's going to take me forever to get in and out of this but to my surprise and I got a zipper so and it's uh, kind of big but for $25 I think I can live with it so this is a small had I known that maybe it maybe it ran big or something I would have got an extra small or had I got it in a box I would have exchanged it but for, 20, for $25 I can live with it I'm wearing it with my black suede boots that I got from Kohl's. I have no idea how long ago. It's got this buckle detail on the sides, got a wedge heel. Just very, very comfortable. So that is my look going out the door today. I hope everyone goes out, has a fantastic week, and we will chat later. Bye bye. Alrighty, and time for just a quick little outfit of the day. So I am wearing some earth shoes from last year that I got from QVC. Love them. They are so comfortable. These ones have like a stacked uh, wooden heel about an inch and a half. They're suede, um, all kinds of cutouts, and they tie up the front, but they do have a little zipper up the back. I am wearing my Women with Control, my suede leggings, our faux suede leggings. Love these also from QVC. Added, uh, my top is Attitudes by Renee. Same person, but the pants she calls Women with Control. Just a really nice legging, so soft with the full leggings. And I know you're probably thinking, didn't you just wear some velvet spanks the other day? These are faux, faux suede. Totally different. Top that I'm wearing is uh, from Attitudes by Renee. We've got different colors of like bronze and beige and tans and coppery brown. So it's got this wide little shark bite type thing. Falls nice. It's got three quarter sleeves. The jacket that I'm wearing is, I actually forgot to take a cardigan, cardigan with me to work today. So this is my emergency card and cardigan that I have at work when I get chilly. So it's got Mazak written across it. And I just left it on. And then I forgot to take it off and hang it up before I left. So anyway, this was my look today. Bling was kind of quiet today. So I've got this. Um, I haven't worn this in a while. So this I got, I think, from Target. Maybe $5 or so. It's got these little uh, gold tassels right here it's got a little plastic crystal right here gold and chain and then here we've got little uh, gold and clear beads going down I just got some Honora pearls on for earrings and kind of like a bronzy color and for the rings I'm just wearing these two lunar rings again I love wearing these together I do think that the next party that I attend for the Touchstone Crystal by Swarovski Jewelry. I will be getting the blush one. So anyway, that's my look for today, and we'll, we'll chat again soon. Bye-bye. Hi, and welcome back to another Outfits of the Day. I didn't expect to be doing these two days in a row, but anyway, I got this uh, sweater from Walmart that I was excited to show you. Just in case it's something you like, you might want to get to Walmart before they are out. They're on clearance for $11. So first, we will start off with the handbag. So I'm just wearing this uh, again from Coach. It's my black tote handbag. Just kind of went with the all black theme that I was wearing. The boots that I am wearing are from uh, JCPenney. Had them a few years now. They're a suede. They go up about uh, mid calf. I think uh, I tried to do this before and I said mid thigh. And yeah, this is a calf. It's got some ties in the back to tie it. Oof, that was a really attractive way to show that to you. So sorry about that. I'm just so ladylike today. The pants that I'm wearing are from QVC. They're from Renee, the Attitudes by Renee, or the Woman with Control is what the pants line is. So it's got this like kind of panel way up here. So it kind of makes it feel like someone's just kind of pressing your stomach in, give you a little bit of control. It's got faux suede panels in it. It's got some nice stretchy polyester in the other panels. Just really, really super comfortable easy care pop them in the washer pop them in the dryer pop them on yourself and her theme the no more jiggle no more wiggle so it just kind of holds you in tight right here so this is a sweater that i got at walmart this past weekend i was going to get some of those turtlenecks that were on sale but i could not find any but i did find this so it's a that eyelash sweater so it's a nice fuzzy it's black and white i'm going to call this a zebra print and like I said, it was normally $16.96 and on sale 
for eleven dollars so if you can find one and you like this kind of print they had some other kind of prints here as well but this is the one i really fell in love with um didn't know what exactly to mix with it because this was kind of busy so i kept my jewelry kind of simple it's all of course touchstone crystal by swarovski so i just wore this chanel today so it alternates between uh pearls and the uh the crystal so you got a little bit of bling and then i think the pearls just give a nice elegant look so i put, paired it with the uh pearl eardrops that i got these earrings that i got the last little shopping haul i got from touchstone crystal um i got my heidi dust ring on it focuses probably not going to focus but you've seen it before right and then that other ring that i just got recently from touchstone crystal on this hand i have got a new pearl ring i put it in the center between two of the uh, bands from the triple threat and so the uh, it's got pearls and then it's also got the uh, crystals on the side and that lunar ring again in the silver loving that and uh keeping with the pearl theme also just got this in a recent uh, little shopping haul from swarovski so it's uh these beautiful wrap pearl necklace it's got these nice shiny beads on it some clear crystal beads and a little bit of gold hardware so just really nice it's stretchy easy to put on the sweater it's got these side uh, drop shoulders it's just really really comfortable it's shorter than i normally would wear for leggings but i just love the look and i figured i was going to be sitting most of the day anyway and i did i pedaled over 20,000 steps again today over eight miles today while i was working so i love it so this is the outfit that i wore today and we will chat again soon i hope you go out and have a fantastic week bye bye and it's just another saturday i am not doing any of these in order by the time i get around to doing my video it's just going to be different days popped in so i probably shouldn't even tell you what kind of day it is but it's a casual look so i'm going to work so i should probably tell you that it's a saturday so um on the bottom i am wearing these isaac mizrahi sneakers they are different shades of gray just a very very comfortable sneaker got those on qvc on the as is pile uh the outfit I'm wearing is also from QVC. It's the uh, Duster blazer, um, Duster cardigan, and uh, the matching pants that go with it. These are by California Barefoot Dreams. Oh my gosh, it is like wearing a blanket. It is just so soft, so comfortable, so heavy. On the, the heat that we have at work, it's on an automated system. So on Saturdays, it's usually pretty cool in there. I can go and turn the thermostat up in my boss's office, but I never do. They also bought me an under desk heater for Saturdays when I work, but I very rarely use it because I'm afraid I'm going to forget to turn it off. But anyway, this uh, duster cardigan, so got nice pockets right here, keep me nice and warm. Let's see if I can get that up so you can just kind of see how thick and cozy this is. It's like wearing a little throw blanket. The sweater that I'm wearing is from Walmart. It probably has to be five years old, maybe even older than that. It's from the last time I lost a lot of weight, and I usually kind of go in five-year spans. So it's a nice shade of purple. It's got sequins sewn into it, so it's just kind of nice and sparkly. So it's kind of like wearing Touchstone Crystal by Swarovski all over. Uh, speaking of Touchstone Crystal by Swarovski, you know I've got to have my bling. So I've got this uh, necklace on that I got from them as well. This has got like a couple of like army green type stones and then this uh, purpley shade that they're calling like a burgundy delight so just really pretty i love wearing this with a v-neck sweater but for this cowl neck i thought it still looked nice the earrings uh, match it it's uh the burgundy delight earrings just a nice little drop earring very pretty the rings that i'm wearing i've got like a purple ring from touchstone crystal by swarovski it's like a purple tanzanite stone and let's see if i can get closer well, I don't think it's going to focus, but that and the lunar ring. So just a kind of purple day. Haven't changed out my nails in a while, but it matches my outfit. So I should probably change these out soon. So anyway, this is my look as I head out the door. I hope that everyone goes out and has a fantastic Saturday. And we will chat again soon, everyone. Bye-bye. And welcome to Friday. It's actually Friday night. I worked about 11 and a half hours today, so I am ready. I've got my towel warmer on with my pajamas in it. I'm ready to finish this little video, wash my face, put my pajamas on, 
have a cup of coffee and sit down and work on YouTube and we'll start responding to some people. So anyway, I've got my look for Friday today and I am wearing, um, on the bottom, I've got these burgundy little booties. They've got uh, ankle booties. They've got about a three inch heel on them. They're from Adrian Vivitani or something like that. They're from Home Shopping Network. Nice uh, faux suede, just really comfortable. I even pedaled while I was at work on my under desk elliptical for over 20,000 steps. Had over eight miles in with a three inch heel. So I am loving that I can do that. The jeans that I'm wearing are these distressed jeans from Just USA. I just got them last night in my fashion box. I know I'm keeping this. Don't know what else I'm keeping, but I know I'm keeping this. It does have so that you could see the skin through here, but I did have some iron on patches on the inside in denim and so I just uh, ironed them on after I decided I was going to keep them so that no skin shows through and they're protected they're not going to get any worse than they are right now so anyway there's just a few areas of kind of distressing but nothing else shows through I'm wearing my Vince Camuto purse today so I actually instead of doing my video this morning I decided to switch my handbags I need to get one of those little felt things that pocketbook liner so that you can just kind of take it out of one and put in the other but anyway um use this i love this today it's a uh, it's got that reptile type print this one's on qvc this one was a return and as is one i don't see anything wrong with it so i'm loving the as is one it's got the zippers on the side that you can put up or down if you wanted to expand it to give you a little extra room uh, outside pocket here it's got a snap and then it's felt lined inside with a great belt the inside let me find my zipper pull got these nice leather zipper pulls the inside is that great belt again it's got uh, these regular pockets right here this side's got the uh, full zippered compartment I didn't use it does come with a shoulder strap so I just left it in there just in case I ever wanted to sell it or if I want to use it I don't have to go looking for it it's right in here and protected with a tissue tissue wrap so it's got a nice zipper closure and it's got like brown some blacks it's almost like a burgundy and a gray so I think it will go with a lot of different things and today I wore it I just messed up my collar my moto jacket that I got from I think this one was from a mix and match box love it nice moto jacket the just the usa jeans i did wear it with the blouse that i kept from my last stitch fix i'm still on the fence about some of the items on that i've extended my checkout a couple of times i wanted to try the pants in a different size but they just haven't become available yet so i'm thinking by monday if they aren't available then i should just if I'm thinking that hard about it, then I probably should just return it. So anyway, they are high-rise pants. I've got this Carl Lockerfield blouse on. And like I said, I'm, I'm not a blouse person, but I just fell in love with it. It's soft, it's frilly, it's kind of romantic. And because I was wearing the moto jacket all day, I didn't have it tucked in, so nobody got to see the belly. So I'm proud about that. I did have some jewelry on today, of course, you know me. I've got these two rings on from Touchtone Crystal. I've got these ice bracelets on, just a couple of different shades that would go with the burgundy. I've got my Heidi Douse ring from QVC. That's the ring from Amazon, from Amazon Prime. I'm wearing this Amos and Andy little bracelet that the girl, the girls Raina and Sabrina love these, so they are always giving me some Amos and Andy bracelets. So I wore that one today and another touch tone crystal stretch bracelet. And uh, of course, touch tone crystal necklace. It's got some crystals, it's got some pearls, some gray pearls, some white pearls, and a uh, little tiered chain. And I've got the hoopla earrings um, in silver from touch tone crystal. So that was my look this Friday. I am freezing. I got cold the other day, maybe while I was out shoveling or something, and I just have not been able to get warm again since. I usually have my heat on 63. I put it up to 70 last night. I've got it on 70 again today. So I hope I'm not coming down with another cold. 
but I really like this with just um, a little bit of the frill sticking out on this. I think that kind of makes it look like you've got a little scarf underneath it. I don't think it's overkill. But anyway, that was my look for Friday today. I hope everyone goes out and has a fantastic weekend. I don't think I did too many videos last this week for um, Outfit of the Day, so I will probably be adding to this. And we will chat again soon. Bye-bye. Hi everyone, welcome back to Outfit of the Day for a very, very, very basic Saturday. I almost didn't do it, do this today because I just felt like it was just so basic that it's pretty boring. And then I thought, well, you know, Nancy, that's what you are. You're a pretty basic, boring person. So I thought, why not uh, share what I wear on a basic day? So again, today's Saturday. I'm going, I went into work for a few hours today. I went to drop off my laptop to get fixed because it died and um, had to go to Target, do a few errands, so just a basic day, but I still was going to be out in public, so I figured I might as well try, at least make an effort to try to look decent. Um, this week we started with snow, we had some days that were below zero, I think we're like minus 11 uh, for two days, one of the days felt like 25 below with the wind chill, one of the days only felt like 11 below, so yeah, that was pretty good. And today we are starting in, we started in the uh, like high 20s and we made it up to 41 degrees. So when I left work, it was like still around 40 degrees. But anyway, so I'm wearing this jacket that I got from the Mix and Match Boutique. Um, and it's a nice, it is a heavy weight. So I mean, for this type of weather, it was perfect. Um, it is a little big, it's a size small, but it's an outer, outer jacket. I'm not going to wear this as a layering piece. So I like it for that. I love the animal print on it. Love the texture and how soft it is. And again, basic day. So I am just wearing it with this ribbed sweater that I also got from one of my mix and match boxes. And, and at the time I wasn't going to keep it because I thought it's just a basic piece. I can get a basic piece anywhere. But then I was realizing that I bought some basic pieces at Target for like half the money but they only lasted like two times that I wore them and in the wash and they were just all stretched out so I thought spend a little more you want to get a basic piece but you want it to last at least a season maybe two so voila I got this so um it's a nice tan piece it's ribbed all the way so it's you know a little clingy but not too bad I originally had on my Touchstone Crystal by Swarovski necklace the one that's in the amber with the antique brass and I liked it better with this, but then when I put that jacket on, it just didn't look right. So I switched to this blue one, and I just love the way it sparkles. It doesn't come out, but it's like as you turn, it, it's got different shades of purple and blue, and it's got the antique silver, and it still went good with the uh, denim jeans, so I thought I would wear that. And I got the earrings that match. Um, you know, I kept it really basic for rings. I just got on this lunar ring in the uh, gold. As you can see, I did my nails, color, color strip nails. I finally changed them out. I don't know why I put it off. It only takes a few minutes. Uh, the jeans that I'm wearing are from Time and True from Walmart. They were on clearance for $7. I wish they had more on clearance for 7 The sneakers that I'm wearing, and I'm stepping on my shoelace, I got these from QVC, and I have had really, really good luck with their as-is items. And um, anyway, so I saw these ones. These are from Rika. They are a nice shade of blue. They are really, really comfortable. Nice cushioning under the heel. The whole foot bed, it's really nice and cushioned. These would be really nice walking sneakers when it's nice enough to start walking outside or if you're doing aerobics. It's just, they're just really nice and cushiony. And I think as is, they were like $39 and I still had six evil pay. So I could pay that over six months. So loving that. So anyway, that was pretty much my outfit of the day. But when I came home, I had an item from Stitch Fix. And this is something that I was never going to do because I like the idea of using Stitch Fix and you get the style boxes. And so you know you've always got that chance to have a five for five to get the discount. But they do have this uh, section that you can shop on their website and it shows you things that they've already sent you and items to get paired with it. I am in desperate, desperate need of sweaters, top set that fit me. So I took a chance. I ordered two. One came in today. So I got this black one by 41 Hawthorne. Of course, it's not showing detail too much, so it's uh, sleeveless. It looks like a wrap, but it's got like a built-in cami that's sewn in. So 
It's going to be perfect, I think. So it's going to look like a wrap, but it's not. And the back has these ribbons, so it's going to have like a keyhole back, and then you tie it in the back. So anyway, I'm just going to quick try this on, see how it fits. And uh, of course, it's, it's a small petite, so I'm really excited to try it because, you know, I have trouble with bat wings. And whenever I say petite, I always think of cranky grandma because she's the one that let me know that I have funny, strange fits on tops because I should be asking for petite sizing. So really excited to try this on. So thanks again, Monica, for that suggestion. And we'll be back. Alrighty, so I am back with this Stitch Fix top from 41 Hawthorne that I got from that when you click on shop when you're on their website to get things. And again, it looks like it's the wrap style, but it's got like a built-in cami, so it's sewn in on both sides. So you've got no, there's no way you're going to expose yourself. Well, if you really try, you could, but I'm not, I'm not going to try. Um, so anyway, it's just, uh, it looks like it's kind of gathered, that kind of like a fold over in the front rounded a little bit longer in the back and kind of stretchier in the back maybe i do have uh, still a little bit of the bat wings here but i don't know if this is a small petite am i almost to the place where i should maybe try extra smalls but i don't know I'm, extra small just seems weird small it's hard enough for me to ask for a small so extra small just seems just it just doesn't sound right but anyway this is the top i think i do like it i'm not going to send it back for this i mean this i can always just sew it over right here tack it down and i am good to go wear it with a black bra or a black another black camisole underneath that goes up a little higher i think it's good to go so anyway i will uh, be back later during the week i hope everyone has fun bye bye and welcome to Friday. I think I have enough of these put together, so I'm probably going to wrap this up today. So just thank you everyone for joining me. I hope that everyone gives this uh, video a thumbs up. I want to thank my subscribers for joining me. I truly appreciate your support. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you click on the red subscribe button way over there. I would love to have you come back and visit. So today is Casual Friday. I am starting the day with some sneakers that I got a few years ago. I think I got these from Pennies. They're black, and but they've got some sparkly little pink accents in them. The jeans that I'm wearing are from Kohl's. They're the Apartment 9. I've got like a, just a little mock turtleneck sleeveless under my thread tank top. Just because it's cold and it's uh, not ready to uh, go show my shoulders when it's so cold outside still. Um, anyway, this top is from Thread Tank. Just love the tops that I got from them. Just They wash, they wear well. Just a really cute style with a heart. Of course, I've got some bling on. I have got on this a uh, wrap bracelet. It's a black wrap bracelet with some crystal crystals by Swarovski on it. Of course, I've got that ring that you've seen probably a million times already, my eclipse ring. This ring is one that I got from Amazon. It's just a nice purple stone, some filigree work, and of course, my lunar ring not sure if that's going to focus or not um i've got these uh, lulu earrings on right here little black swarovski crystals and then this uh, necklace that i really like it kind of gives it a casual look i mean it's got all these beautiful crystals right here and just a black and crystal and some silver to it but then it's on like a leather braided chain so i think that kind of gives it a nice kind of casual look but it still looks nice so anyway that is my look for friday I hope everyone had a fantastic week. I'm probably going to go to work tomorrow, but I need some other things to work on. So I'm going to try to cut this short and see you all later. I hope you give this video a thumbs up. I would love to hear your comments. Talk to you soon, everyone. Bye-bye. Have a great weekend.